Hey, what's up guys, it's Jack211 welcome back to the 11th episode of the Windcraft Let's Play. And as you can see, I got to level 32 as I said in the last episode, in between the episodes where I grinded in that spot over there around Nemrak. And then I also bought some stuff on the trade market. And those were these things right here. So I'll start off by equipping these boots. They are quite stronger, better than these ones. They don't really do a lot. And I got these dead sands as well. I give quite a lot of HP compared to these things and a lot of poison. So I'm going to choose those as well. They give like three times the amount of poison. And then we also got this thing, the Fisher. Uh, it's very strong, but it's for level 48. So kind of like bored a little in front of myself. And then there's the Lydian thing that gives a like 500 in poison it's quite insane but yeah those are the, basically the things that I bought right there nothing too crazy you know but today we're gonna do start off with the sandy scandal and then we're gonna do the Christmas chaos episode next time where we also do the meaningful holiday which both are Christmas quests so we're gonna try and do the green gloop and the sandy scandal quests today and maybe a little bit more depends on if I get to a new level I don't think there are any other oh wait kingdom of sand sand swept tomb okay so there are some things that we can do but let's just start with the sandy scandal and I think it starts up here it's the quest that is required to open up the dungeon and oh, wait not the dungeon the what's it called the um, the bank yeah the bank is what I'm trying to say so we're gonna talk to this guy and he, there's been some robberies and he'd like us to check him out so first robbery is over here and there's no one in here yeah quest book updated you're now leaving Elmouche kinda weird but alright so we have these bandits here and this is the shop owners memories of this situation whoa so basically he tries to make peace with the crooks and he's got a knife he's got a knife and what does he do he demands to get some TNT downstairs. There's a code to it. He's gonna decorate his f necklace with his fingers. Wow. <coughs> Excuse me. Still be able to grab the pig with your fingers. Yeah. And he just cut him. I don't see any cut though. Could be quite cool if some of his arm turned red, of course. No more violence, please. Okay, so the code is 7812. I better remember that as well. I'm just running around up here. Like, wow. Scary. <laughs> and then they knocked him out. Such crazy people, man. Crazy people. Well, all right. So now we gotta go down to the vault, and we already know the code, so that's nice. Seven, eight, one, two, and we go in. There's not much TNT in the in the vault. Only small things. So, yeah, this knife has been dropped. I guess we gotta return to the detective. With our information. Yeah, I'm already doing that. What, what does it want me to do? I just inspected the vault. What is it? What does it mean? I just did open it. What is it on about? I really have to reset right here. Um, 
That's not very nice. I think I have to go to a complete other server. Oh my god, why does this... This does not work properly. I'm gonna go to a server where there's not many people. Because then it is less laggy like it is right now on that previous server. And we don't want none of that. So if it will just load in. Alright, nice. I'm going down again. And it's still open. So basically it's broken. Well that's not nice. Can I still not do anything? Open the vault. Yeah, I already did that. Do I really have to? Do I really have to? Wow. Kill. And I spawn in Nisak. Ugh. That's just annoying. Stupid quest. Doesn't even work. Well, don't I have like Rachni? I cannot use Rachni for anything. Well, then I have to go all the way over to Elmush again. Nice. running down there let's go come on this is taking ages why is windcraft so glitchy four emeralds not worth the wait I guess should be a chest right there as well yeah oh yeah nothing crazy just some bad stuff there's a long way to Elmush. Very annoying. Three emeralds. One shot. Let's go. And I have to go this place. This way. We are soon there. I think we are like halfway. We're soon at the savannah. So that's a good sign, I guess. It's just super annoying with these quests that do not work. It frustrates me quite a bit. Look at this. A secret passage. To the other side of the wall. Oh. Better leave for now. Wow. This cave is not dangerous. Stupid. So I have to go to Elmouche instead. And I have to do one of the Christmas uh, quests to go through that cave. Kind of annoying, I must say. Kind of annoying. But we're basically here now again. And I think we have to go through that cutscene again as well. I hope not at least. But I think that's sadly what we have to go through kind of depressing I know I know it's kind of depressing <laughs> and the shop is right here okay open the vault yes I'ma do that seven Eight. Am I doing it slow enough for you, Windcraft? Oh, 
So now it updated. Wow. Inspect the vault. Yeah, I just did. Come on. Yep, that's what I'm gonna do. Come on. Exit the house finally. Stupid quest. Now get the second witness report. Yes, yes, yes. I don't care what you gotta say. I gotta go up here. Now I will be able to. Oh, scroll merchant. So the scroll merchant is just running around up here on his rooftop garden, having some fun, I guess. That's something you can have on your rooftop garden. Just checking him some stuff out, you know. And there are the bandits again with the TNT now. And where are they going? And they're going in there. So, um, yeah, rip. Yeah, rip you, man. The gods did not hear you. And some something just exploded. Oh, and the rubbers are coming out again. No TNT, but some weapons instead. And they're running over there. That guy was just about to run in there. Wow, he's the bandit leader. Well. So now I've got to go into that big house. It's not that it's not really that big, but in this town it's apparently quite big. I'm gonna go upstairs. Uh, would you what you say I've done is whoa. Would you have a look at this? So the two weapons are gone. They are not warriors and they are not mages, so archers and assassins. Well, Yes, please, please let me go to the Almush Bank again. Praise the Lord that I can leave now. Oh. An iron golem. Why was that iron golem not there when they robbed the place? That's silly. What was that iron golem doing? Uh... Okay, Almush Sentry. Urgent reports of a robbery. Okay, we know what to do, guys. We know what to do. Yeah, I just spoke to you. Come on. Yeah, I'm gonna go to the house quickly. I wonder if there's a timer or something. Or you could just take infinite time. Okay, so it seems like they blew up something as well here. Okay, so we're going in here. And he's right there, the bandit leader. And two other bandits. Arr, maybe you'll help us pull the heist if I give you some gold we just stole. Yes. Aha, I had a feeling. We had a guard on our tail. I wouldn't want to wear out my new stolen weapons killing you. I'll just trap you in here with all of this TNT. This will blow up in a few seconds. Good luck getting out of here. Wow. What a mad lad. Um, how am I supposed to get up though? Right here or something? Yeah, probably. And I made it. But where am I now? Oh. 
Oh, so they went in here. And I just found that place where they were trying to go. They left a bunch of emeralds and gold. Okay, so now I'm in the bus room, I guess you can say. Quite beautiful. Yes, I decided to uh, follow you. What about it? Two birds with one stone. Escaping the bank and killing this pest. Wow! What a mean guy. Block the entrance, bandits. Uh, how did they do that? Okay, so there's the bandit leader, and he's got 100,000 HP. Well, that's not cool. I just need to kill his followers. And then I can survive. Oh, he placed some TNT. I'm gonna defuse it. And I defused it. Nice. I'm just get rid of his minions. Can I? I cannot even grab all of this stuff. Wow. So, can you play some more TNT, please? Yep, 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 exactly what I want. Please don't jump over to me. Oh my god. The timing was great. It just needed to be placed there and there then, because it's been placed there and there. Whoa, that guy got wrecked. Oh, they're placing some more TNT. Oh no, the same place as before. How many more things do I have to clear out? And now he's just standing over there. He doesn't know what to do. Oh, he's still going for me. And the same place again. This must surely be the last one. Yeah. And now they are fleeing because I beat him up. And I got the leader. Just for the fun of it, I guess I'm gonna destroy this guy. And this guy, mm, this guy over here. You ain't stand a chance. 200 EXP, wow. Drop it in so I can escape. Yes, thanks. And I'm out of here. Now I should go talk to the bank guard again. All right. Not too shabby, other than the problems I had with the quest at first, where I got stuck. Thanks, 22,000 XP though, that's quite a lot. Didn't get much else from it. Ooh. Quite nice, I must say, quite nice. Okay, um... Maybe I could buy some armor now. I'm almost level 33 and I need a new helmet and a new chest plate. I can use this thing and not this thing. I don't have the required things for it, but that's fine. I got 849 HP right now. I just need new chest plate, but I need to find it somewhere else than here. We dropped some stuff for me. Oh. I got the leggings. Already got some good leggin leggings, so I don't want them. Sandswap tomb. Key, nice. But now we can use the bank. So that's cool. Get rid of some of all these things. This thing. This one. And these two can be gone. <gasps> So now we want to do the green gloop. Talk to Ozepair. Oh wait, where is he? Okay, I know where he is. 
One thing I don't know is, however, if it's a male or female. Because these names, they're kind of weird sometimes. Kind of weird. Oh my god. I'm being followed. Nice. Okay, so here he is. I'll talk to this guy. I need this. Uh, so we need this kind of scoop thing to even get in there. Level 33. Nice. Um, bringer of red sands. What's that supposed to mean? Didn't do much though. Had kind of a crazy name, I guess. Overrated name. Something along those lines. So he should be right down here. You can see the bottle merchant. Welcome to Jotburn's Glass Blowery. What can I do for. What? Oh, another stinking adventurer, eh? The many have been coming up to me recently asking for a bloody slime scooper. Is my brother a man stopped working again? I swear he's addicted to that slug. Anyways, for me to scoop, you'll need to get five soft sand. Come back to me once you've gotten a hold of it. You can dig it up from those sand piles around the desert. Wow, what a guy. He doesn't seem too friendly. Well, how do I find these sand piles then? Sand crawler, please no. Okay, so a sand part, soft sand thing. Is there any soft sand down here? Uh, quicksand bandit thing. Doesn't seem like any uh, friendly people. Where do I find this soft sand at? I can go all the way down as well. Militarists. What's happening down here though? Sand golem. And he got begun, I guess. Wow. Let's go up here and over here. Oh, there's a chest with a bunch of stuff. Uh, no legendaries, however. Well, I'll take these two things. Where is that sand then? Shifting sand pile. Maybe that's it. Or what? Oh my god. Okay, so I have to kill these piles of sand. And a bunch of things spawn out of them. Holy moly. Is this guy trying to kill me? I have to find five of these though. A scarab, no thanks. Where are these sand things spawning? Oh, another one. Only two things, and they are gritty zombies. Give decent amount of EXP though. I must give that to them at least. Lion Lair. There's also something up there. Let me actually try and go up there and see. Oh my god, these guys are doing a lot of damage. I cannot fight back, however, when I'm up here. Is there like an entrance or something to this place? Oh, these guys, they... They are the star things of this place. A 
I didn't see how much EXP. 200! 200 EXP, that's quite good actually. I still don't know why they uh, have this star. Oh, the key guardian. Let's try and destroy him. And I got him. And there's another one of these things right here. Let's go. Way too many things in my inventory. I wait with those things. And let me just take another drink. And then right there. What about these boots? Yeah, I'm gonna keep them. Please, where is the sand piles at? Um, I don't really see them anywhere. I got four of them already. Just need the last one. What is this supposed to be? Danger? Oh wait. Is this quicksand? No, it's the same person from before. Junes. I th she joins me? What? Another silly discovery. And quicksand discovery found. Got 3,700 EXP from that. That's quite weird. Empire Ruins. I didn't know that. How do we get up, though? Uh, Where is she going? Yeah, let's see what's down here. There's a secret entrance right there. Oh, she left. Oh, she's reading. What is this place even? And she will just keep on talking for ages upon ages. This episode will be quite a long one, guys. I'm sorry. The third library I found in the smallest two. Hmm. It's quite amazing with these discoveries in the desert because deserts are already always kind of like ancient and such compared to forests and such. Who? I'm just doing. Oh. We're just going. And there's a fire torch right there. A redstone torch to be exact. Now you can just run around up here. And there seems to be nothing else, really. Kind of weird. Children born after this great grandchildren had died. Oh! And a secret door opened. Oh! So what's in here? Tell me more, Junes! There must have been books in here, not for public knowledge. Is life. Yeah. That was weird, though. I need to find some sand now. I should not have jumped in that thing. That thing right there. That was stupid. However, I cannot find that silly sand. I was only able to... Oh. The key guardian is here again. Okay, I'm gonna just destroy this guy, alright? I'm gonna just destroy him. Oh no, his minions are after me. There's something in there. These bandits, I just want to fight this sand. Oh my god.
god, this is taking ages. Absolutely ages. Mm, come on. Scarab, that scarab is not even real, and this thing just attacked me. Where am I supposed to find these things if I cannot even see them? Oh, there's someone else also looking for them, I think. That's not good for me. Let's go up here and check. Is that where we came down, came up from? I think it is. Okay, uh, there's not any sand over here either. Why is this so hard? So those star things over there, I think it's a great spot to grind. Another spider over there. However, no sign of the sand yet. Where the flip is it? Oh, the key guardian again. I'm gonna destroy him again then. If he keeps on wanting to fight me, I'll surely fight him. And his minions fought me again. Now I have like three keys. But I keep on losing more and more HP. I'm not gonna go down there again. <laughs> Maybe there is something here. A chest with practically nothing in it. There's nothing down here though. That's weird. Oh, sand! Please. Finally. Wow, that took its time, and these scarabs are so damn fast. So there is still fire after that explosion here, apparently. I don't really get that, but alright. Just have to get up here. Oh my god. Yeah, please, give me that bucket. Yep, and now I have to go over to that uh, Elisturb guy. So that's what we're going to do. And, yeah, this episode is super long. It's quite insane, actually, how long it is. Thirty-four minutes as of yet. There's also sand right there, oh my god. I should have looked other places in the desert as well, but I'm just too lazy. Okay, so now I can go down into the bottom of this cave. And get the slime that Elusturb wants, I guess. And I gotta go all the way down. Because why not? I think that's at least where the, the correct... Oh yeah, this is the place! Definitely must be. There's a lot of them at... Whoa! Okay, already got some of the slime now. I just need eight of them. K 
Give me some slime. Didn't even hit it right there. Wow. And I've got eight of them now. Now to the top of the thing, the cave, whatever. Slime cave. 80 XP. Not too shabby, actually. Maybe a, a decent grinding spot. Just all the way up. We're going all the way up. We're almost there though. I think I think so at least. Just have to go up here. I'm not the fastest guy in the world. And yeah, we can see the the fresh air now. We can smell it as well. Uh, finally we're done hope you guys enjoyed this episode all right i'll see you guys next time bye bye